All right. Hello, everybody. My name is Keon, and for my 20 time idea, I decided to do the guitar. So, the reason I decided to do the guitar is because when I was a little kid, about maybe seven or eight, when I lived back east, I would go to lessons frequently, and I really enjoyed it. It was a really fun thing to do. It really kind of relaxed me, and I really picked it up as a hobby. But, unfortunately, when I moved here, I stopped all, basically, all my connections with the guitar, and it just sat in the corner of my room for who knows how many years. So, I really actually struggled when it came to picking the idea of playing the guitar. Um, it wasn't so easy at first to come up with the idea of playing the guitar because, you know, I was going back and forth. Originally, I was going to maybe do a song with Julius. He was going to make a beat, but we decided that that may not work out so well. So then, I was kind of stuck. So, eventually, I went home. I talked to my mom about it, and she said, here, why don't you maybe try to play the guitar? And I was like, okay, yeah, because I really wanted to pick up a new hobby, and I thought maybe that's something I could be passionate about. So I decided to pick up the guitar and go along with that. So, and I set a goal for myself, which was to be able to learn the chords and kind of be fluent with the guitar. Because obviously, I'm not going to be a master like Jimi Hendrix in the little time we had, but I thought maybe I could kind of get used to it and maybe I'd really find a passion while doing it. So I learned a lot during this whole thing, like um, th during this whole uh, project and I think a lot that I learned was mostly about myself. So when I heard that when Mr. Oi was saying this is more about the process rather than the whole product as a whole, I got really excited because it kind of reminded me of uh, I recently just played on the football team where we were very process driven and when it comes to stuff like that if you have a good foundation and a good process then the product will come by itself so I thought okay I've had experience with the whole process situation so this shouldn't come too hard but it's I realized that it's different for everything right when you're playing an instrument or doing a sport or drawing the process for everything comes all differently. So I had to set up a, a totally new, fresh plan, that I've, something I've never done before when playing the guitar. So what I planned out is every Wednesday, or every Wednesday as soon as I could, I would meet with my friend, and he would give me lessons on Wednesdays, and uh, we would basically learn the basic chords of the guitar. You know, simple stuff, and maybe I could get some rhythm while playing, and Hopefully, if I learned those, we would get to more advanced stuff. And obviously, time, when it came to having time for that, it wasn't such an easy thing because both of our schedules were busy. So along with the lessons, I downloaded some apps that I found in the App Store that were actually really helpful. And basically, I also had some CDs that my mom found, which were pretty cool because they were actually videotapes from me when I was a little kid. But they were really kind of messed up because they were really old and just dusty. So after a while, they would just kind of tune off and like uh, wouldn't work after they would play for a little bit. But that was kind of cool seeing me play back then as a little kid. So in my head, I had this old plan and it all kind of sounded like a bulletproof idea. And I guess it kind of took a little too long for me to realize that, oh, maybe playing the guitar may not be as easy as I really expected because in the beginning of the whole process everything was going well. I had lessons and I was working well. Uh, me and my friend were meeting. I was using the CDs or as much as I could and I had some paper from before with chords and little songs such as a, a song you guys might know, Skip to My Lou. <laughs> I tried to do that. I was slowly working on that and everything was going well until a few weeks into the project, or maybe more than a few weeks, I kind of started to get bored of the process. I started to lose passion for my, for my instrument. I started to lose passion for what I was doing. And I stopped meeting with my friend. I stopped using the stuff. And I realized I found myself, and it was too late to fix everything. I found myself, I was getting further and further away from my main goal. And I think that's when I realized that, you know, I started to realize that I may have made a dis uh, mistake for choosing the guitar, but I still am really, I don't regret choosing the guitar for my 20-time topic, 
And the reason for that is because I learned a lot about myself and I learned what I'm capable of and maybe what I need to work in just in life in general. So I wanted to kind of pick up a new hobby when doing this because I really wanted something to do that could kind of relax me or I wanted to do more than just a sport because I wanted to have a different view of everything, you know, maybe open up my horizons to other stuff. So I learned that, you know, obviously I'm not going to become a musician because I learned that obviously my passion for that wasn't there. So I think I was more in love with the idea rather than I wasn't in love with playing the guitar. I was think I, the reason I wanted to do it because I was in love with the idea of being able to play it. So that's basically how I got here now. I mean, I don't I honestly can I can honestly say that I probably will not continue playing the guitar in the future. But, you know, everybody's different. The guitar just wasn't my passion, but for you, it may be something you really like to play. Like you just saw Julius, loved to, he's a great musician, he loves to play music, and it's not, just not the same for everyone. But, through my research, I found a lot of cool stuff and very positive aspects about playing the guitar, such as it relieves stress. You can, it helps you communicate your emotions, like when you play your own songs, when you get really good, people get really into it. Like if you see some videos, I've seen videos of Jimi Hendrix, he goes crazy on stage, like he really gets into it. And you feel achieved, which kind of was unfortunate because I didn't get that sense of achie achievement when I played the guitar. You get your own personal style, and it kind of teaches disciplines and patience because you really have to do a lot of practice to get good at it. It doesn't just come like that. You have to practice a lot. And most importantly, it's a really fun thing to do. If you enjoy playing instruments, I would really suggest to try the guitar out and maybe see if that's your passion, if you want to pick up a new hobby or not. And thank you for tuning in.